Pacific Fleet Commander Admiral Haney came to Sasebo to thank USS Guardian crew members for their efforts and to answer the questions. Well, I'm here in Japan visiting with Navy leadership, uh, our leadership from the U.S. side as well as the leadership of the Kaijo Jetai, the Japanese leadership. And since I was here and understanding the uh, tremendous uh, work that the crew of USS Guardian did from the point of which the ship grounded, the crew worked diligently, quite frankly, to in fact work to try to save the ship but even more importantly, they got all 79 of their crew members off that ship and safely back here to Japan. That part I'm especially grateful and thankful of. The Admiral shared his feelings on how the crew responded to adversity. One thing I will say about the crew of Guardian, they've gone through quite a bit, but it shows you the resiliency we have of our sailors, including the crew of USS Guardian, and how uh, when faced with adversity, uh, could in fact uh, make it through that as one team working together, which is what our United States Navy is all about. Admiral Haney's trip to Sasebo may have been all about USS Guardian, but his mission remains to better serve the entire Pacific Fleet. Well, my message goes out really to the whole fleet. Uh, I look at the four deployed naval forces here in Japan, including the crew of Guardian, that the work they do day in and day out uh, is all about the priorities I have for the Pacific Fleet. That business of having credible capability forward, business of working with our, our allies, partners, and friends, and having a business of being ready, and the fact of the matter of having a crew, the talent that we cannot take for granted of valuing our people. Petty Officer Che Rose, Fleet Activities, Sasebo, Japan.